Hi, I'm Leslie DeLuca. I'm a real estate broker. I help people buy and sell real estate right here on the beautiful Monterey Peninsula. So when you're looking for a house, how many should you look at before you write a contract? I get that question all the time. And Sarah T from Seaside asked and wrote in, how many homes should I look at before making an offer? Well, you know, that's arbitrary because the home buying process starts before you ever step in the house if you're working with a good agent because you will know what your budget is, what your long-term goals are, and you'll, I always tell people to write down three non-negotiables and that would be if you have to have a garage, if you have to have a fenced backyard, if you have to have a fireplace. Those are non-negotiables. Now, do those change sometimes? Sometimes they do. But how many houses? If you walk into a house and it's the first one you see and it fits all of your criteria and it's in the area you want and it brings joy to you, write an offer. You don't have to go, oh, well, we need to see 10 more. It, it, if, 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 it, if it ticks off all of your buttons, then write an offer. On the other hand, don't ever, ever, ever let anyone talk you into writing an offer or tell you this is the best you're going to do or you know, well, you, you have this, this, and this. If you don't feel 100% happy and excited to write this offer and if you don't get this house you'll cry don't do it really don't and and that's that's the best advice i could give you and i tell everybody it's sort of like when you find that house it's sort of like when you find your husband or your wife or your boyfriend or girlfriend like you just know right you just know it just fits and it's the same thing with when you buy a house you walk in and you go oh man this is it it just feels good so there's no number it just goes on if it's a good deal if it ticks off all your buttons and you want to I've had people I've had people look for two years which is cool and I've had people walk in the first house they see and they buy it so that's what that's what you want to do just be prepared know what you want and if it's good write an offer